Hi, I'm Mary Beth Carosa. I currently serve in the Maryland House of Delegates representing Worcester and Wicomico counties. And I'm proud to announce that I recently stood with Governor Larry Hogan and announced my intention to serve in the Maryland Senate. I believe everything in my life has led up to this point. Working in my family business over the years really made an impression for my entire life. And that really inspired me when it came time to think about what I wanted to do after I graduated from college and I realized that I wanted to be in public service. My best years in public service were when I served as Deputy Chief of Staff for Governor Ehrlich. I've also been very fortunate to work in President George W. Bush's administration at the Pentagon under the leadership of Secretary Donald Rumsfeld. And for the past three years, I've been proud to serve as a member of the House of Delegates representing Worcester and Wicomico counties. After all that hard work, I am so grateful that my constituents and voters sent me to Annapolis with close to 74% of the vote. She brings a lot to Maryland, a lot to us, a lot to the community. I've been able to take positions of strength in Annapolis because I've heard directly from so many families, so many small businesses, so many healthcare workers, so many watermen, so many farmers, so many teachers. They come and they explain to you how it really works in their world. And when you understand how policies directly affect your constituents, you are in a position, whether you're in committee, you're on the House floor, whether it's a vote, you can take strong positions of support for your constituents. I'm supporting Mary Beth because I think she's one of the best people in this area to represent us, um, Worcester County and this whole area. She um, is one of the hardest workers I've ever met. I've been proud to be a strong partner with Governor Larry Hogan. If you look at what we've done together over the past three years, you look at all the increase in jobs. Mary Beth has been working with us every step of the way. When we went from losing 100,000 jobs to gaining 130,000 jobs, and we went from cutting our uh, unemployment rate from 8% to 3.8%, that's the second highest private sector job growth in America. And it would not have happened without Mary Beth DeRose's help. I'm very proud to tell you that she has a 100% rating from the Maryland Business for Responsive Government. Many of you know I have made it a passion and a priority to strengthen career, trades, technology, education. So we can grow a younger, skilled workforce to meet the needs of our employers and fill the lucrative high-tech jobs. I go to Worcester Tech, I take HVAC, and she's helped tremendously with the funding of that school, and she's been pushing trades in the area, because there's a lot of jobs need to be filled thanks to her. Governor Hogan has introduced and passed a budget with no new taxes three years in a row. I'm a member of the Budget Committee and I've played a key role in supporting Governor Hogan and pushing that budget through. And I've never voted to raise your taxes. She is a mover and a shaker and I love what she's doing for this county. I also want to talk a little bit about the heroin opioid crisis that affects every community. Governor Hogan understands that the only way that we're going to be successful and fighting back on the heroin opioid crisis is to work with our local communities. I'm excited about this opportunity to serve even more constituents because that's what public service is all about. It's about understanding the priorities of your constituents and going up and representing them in Annapolis. And I am absolutely committed to quality constituent service just as I've done the past three years as a delegate I will have the opportunity as a state senator to serve even more constituents in all three counties, Somerset, Wicomico, and Worcester counties. She spent her entire life here. She grew up here. And when it comes to us trying to get our agenda through, having that one extra vote in the Senate, you know, right now they can override every single veto. And Mary Beth Carroza votes with us. My public service is about you. It's about serving the people of all three counties. I'm excited also about having the opportunity to be an even stronger partner with Governor Hogan, to use all of that experience and put that to work for you every day. I will fight for you.